Hello friends, this is Vani from Viva Sew and Style. I'm a self-taught sewist. I've been sewing for almost two years now. I've fallen in love with big four patterns and I am particularly interested in easy beginner friendly patterns. So in today's video, I am bringing to you yet another pattern that is so easy that in my opinion, you can put it together in one hour and then you will have a gorgeous dress that you can wear. So, and also I share similar patterns on my channel quite a few times and quite often. So do check back frequently. Also, please subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. If you have subscribed, I'm very thankful. So this is the pattern that I'm going to discuss today. It is new look 6597 and it's a 2019 pattern. It's a knit dress. I made it in this long version that the model is wearing and uh, but I made it sleeveless. This dress has only two pattern pieces. For me, it took more time cutting the dress out rather than sewing it because I wanted to be very careful when cutting my fabric. And uh, so cutting took me almost, I would say 45 minutes to an hour but the actual sewing of the dress took me about an hour and that including the surging of the seams inside. So this pattern has only two pieces I think I mentioned that earlier and then there is no neck band you just fold tuck it under for the armholes and the neck band and that's how you do the finishing. So some key tips that I would like to share for success with this dress. Number one thing is fabric. Because as you can see, especially in this view in the red one and here, I am not sure why on the model either they have chosen is some kind of a fabric that doesn't drape too good. But this dress gives a very nice movement, especially I'm loving walking in this dress. And I'm going to uh, put pictures and give you guys a more in-depth view of how this dress looks like. But when I walk, you know, the movement and the slinkiness is what makes this dress. So it's very important to choose the right kind of fabric. Only then you will get the right kind of look. So now let's talk about fabric. So this is the fabric that I used. And if you have been following me, you guys know that I buy a lot of fabric from Walmart. From their Walmart bundles section. So this so when I hang, you can see how this fabric hangs. So that's what I mean that, you know, if you want a dress and that, that gives the proper, you know, flowiness and the femininity, then go for a slinkier knit fabric. This particular one, is I believe a techno scuba crepe knit fabric. You can find similar fabrics on Amazon. Uh, but of course, you cannot beat the price point if you find it in Walmart. Um, like I paid $3 for two yarn bundles and I bought two of them. So I have I made this dress out of one and one I have intact uh, that I am going to use in another project. 
so what i am trying to say is that uh, this fabric you know it has fluidity plus a little weight to it and that's exactly what you need when you are going for a dress because if you choose a very tight knit fabric then it will just you know stand and it won't have the movement and if you choose a fabric that has the drape but it's too thin and does not have enough body then also it will not hang so one thing i forgot to mention is that i bought this pattern in the 99 cent clearance sale from hobby lobby and a lot of people must have picked up this pattern so if you have this pattern in your stash don't think too hard pull this out and if you have one or two hours of sewing time just go to your walmart pick up one of their value bundles and for under 10 dollars you will have yourself a gorgeous dress okay so enough talking now let me show how this dress looks on me and hopefully i will have inspired you guys enough that you will give it a try and sew it up and when you do please share your feedback your thoughts comments with me also subscribe to my channel and also leave your comments and your thoughts i love to connect with people and i love reading your comments with that enjoy my little fashion show and i hope you have a great rest of the day bye bye